a dreary day, but even on a cloudy day, there's still beauty in our area. The viewer pick of the day comes from Dan Bassard out of Fort Wayne. This was taken early this morning. You see the snow covering over the bushes and trees. A little bit of sun glimpsing out of the early this morning, but we haven't seen too much sunshine for us. This is a live look at our gorgeous city. As you can tell, cloudy skies, some still snow on the ground, but the road conditions are looking great at the moment. It is 33 degrees in Fort Wayne with cloudy skies. Winds a little breezy coming out the southwest at nine miles an hour. So look at the current temperatures across our area. We're just hugging along the freezing point into the low 30s, but with the wind chill factor, it feels much colder. It feels like into the mid 20s for us. That's because our winds are coming out from the southwest around five to 10 miles an hour. The good news is we should expect to see our winds start to die down as we get through tomorrow morning. Now looking at the storm track radar, you can tell there's some few little flurries, but we're seeing mainly cloudy conditions as we begin to dry out for the night. Now, as we take a look at our visible satellites, you can tell the, the heavy gray colors indicate all that cloud cover we're seeing. So we're seeing lots of moisture into our area. So looking across our state, down towards our south, they're seeing a little bit more clear skies, but areas off towards our north, we're seeing a little bit more clouds into our region. So weather headlines we want to talk about for the week ahead. We're staying dry. Temperatures will be above normal. Good news for us, but the gloomy weather is still sticking around for us. And here's a look about what's going on. The reason why we're seeing that cloud cover is that we have a high pressure system off towards our west. That's feeding winds that will come out from the northwest for tomorrow. So we'll see the air hitting the lakes and that's going to keep giving us cloud cover as we get through throughout the week. But we will stay dry. A low pressure system starts to form into Tuesday and a Wednesday, but this high is going to block this system from moving up towards the north. So expect to see dry conditions throughout the week. Looking at the future track for tonight and tomorrow again, Staying dry, a few little flurries here and there. I think we mainly dry, but if you do get hit by some of these flurries, nothing too much to worry about for your morning's commute into Monday, but still seeing cloudy skies throughout Monday into Tuesday morning for us. And we're going to continue to stay dry for the next couple days. Look at the rain chances again, boom dry all the way through Thursday and then Friday. There's a slim chance for some isolated wintry mix, but really nothing too much to worry about at the moment. As we take a look at the temperatures, we're going to see Temperatures gradually warming up by the 40s towards the weekend, still above average this time of year for us. Overnight lows tonight will be dropping back down below freezing in the upper 20s. But for your morning's commute, we will see a little bit great driving conditions as we are left with dry and mostly cloudy skies. But looking at your bus stop forecast, again, a chilly start. You might need your jackets for tomorrow. But as we get towards into tomorrow, we'll see our over our afternoon highs into the mid 30s. As you take a look at your setup forecast, it's a very gloomy week, but there's some positive notes for us. We will see our highs into the mid to upper 30s and then back into the 40s by the weekend. Oh, that's good. And perhaps sunshine next weekend. A little bit of sunshine nice. slowly coming back. <laughs> we, we need the sun. We'll need